Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Before starting the video, if you have not subscribed our channel till now, then please subscribe it. And if you have not watched our previous videos, then watch it. In this video, we will replace alert message using toaster notification. Before the start, anything let's run and see whatever we added till now it's working fine or not. See, everything is working fine. Before adding toaster notification, let's correct some small things. Let's change URL pattern so instead of Spring Boot, it should be Muddy Java. We need to change in all the places including JS, Ajax call URL as well. Let's make it little more generalized. Let's check it's working or not. See it's working fine, so same way you can keep whatever string you want. Let's add the shortcut icon on the browser tab. See it's coming. You can use any image as a shortcut icon. Add copyright icon you can use directly or code also. Let's integrate font awesome library, so can use some more icon as well. Example address icon is not appropriate so we'll use font and icon. It's not loading icon, so let's restart the server. See now is coming this is more appropriate, the same way we can use any other icon also. Let's add some logic to change the icon when edit and text for the button. So make it simple, we'll add the flag to the controller. 
based on that icon and text will change. See it's working perfectly. Without address line, address won't complete so let's add. And you will see with the help of very minimal changes it will work. See it's working with the help of very small changes. Same way you can add as many as fields. Always keep the same type of files in the proper folder like JS, CSS, Images. Let's add the toaster to display the notification for save update and delete. Toaster code 7 API is available and that is really very easy to integrate. There is a demo link available so you can go through that. Down code also available. CDN link also available so don't need to download JS and CSS can use directly.
Before continuing with notification, let's add some changes in JSON response in the service class. Seeing now JSON response and looking perfect with title and message. Let's first implement for save and update, later we'll implement for delete. See that's it, let's check notification is coming or not. It's updating but notification is not coming. Oops there is an error, let's see and fix it. It's happening because of order, so remember always query mint js is the first one. See it's coming. Always remember and make sure that jQuery min JS in the first place. See add update both are working perfectly fine. Now let's add toaster notification for delete as well. The notification contains HTML because before delete confirmation will come.
let's check is coming or not. Oops error, let's fix first. Let's check again. See it's coming but not 100% perfect so let's make it. See it's working. See, the application is working perfectly fine. Let's review whatever we added. This is the last video for Spring Boot and Bootstrap integration. Same way you can add hundreds or fields in hundreds of forms. Till now whatever we added that is basic, I will add advanced level video also. I hope you are enjoying videos so please like the video, and please subscribe our channel.